Do you know why the Earth is the only planet with life? It is precisely because of Earth's position from the Sun. Earth is close enough to get energy from the Sun and distant enough from being burned off. There is a precise calculation connecting the star and the planet revolving round it, and it is mentioned in one of the ancient Hindu script. As the ancient Indian polymath Varoha Mahira delved into the realm of astrology, astronomy, and divination. He could feel the weight of centuries of knowledge and wisdom, resting upon his shoulders. His magnum opus was the Brihat Samhita, a Sanskrit text that covered a wide range of topics including planetary movements, lunar and solar eclipses, weather prediction, rainfall, agriculture, architecture, and gemology. It was a compendium of knowledge that had been accumulated over centuries, and Varaha Mahira had added his own observations and insights to it. But it was one particular calculation that would make the Brihat Samhita famous for centuries to come. The calculation was simple yet profound. It stated that the diameter of the Sun multiplied by 108 gave the distance between the Sun and the Earth. It was a revelation that had never been made before, and it was a testament to the incredible knowledge and wisdom that had been accumulated by Indian scholars over the centuries. The chapter that contained this revelation was titled Bhavana Kosha, and it dealt with the description of the physical universe. It was a chapter that contained a wealth of information on astronomical calculations related to the Sun, Moon, planets, stars, and constellations. It was a chapter that contained the secrets of the universe, waiting to be discovered by the intrepid seeker of knowledge. The number 108 was considered sacred in many Indian traditions and was believed to have spiritual significance. And it was for this reason that it was used as a multiplier for symbolic or spiritual reasons rather than for purely scientific or mathematical reasons. But the calculation was not just a spiritual, or symbolic one. It was a calculation that was based on accurate and detailed observations of celestial phenomena, and it had practical applications in various fields. The Brihat Samhita was known for its precise calculations and its ability to predict weather patterns, rainfall, and other natural phenomena with a high degree of accuracy. To understand the calculation, one needed to know the diameter of the Sun, which was approximately 1.39 million kilometers. One also needed to know the average distance between the Earth and the Sun, which was approximately 149.6 million kilometers. By multiplying the diameter of the Sun by 108, Varaha Mahira had arrived at a figure that was very close to the actual average distance between the Earth and the Sun. In Vedic astronomy, the diameter of Earth was described to be 8,000 miles which is equivalent to approximately 12,874 kilometers. Diameter of the Sun equals 108 times the Earth diameter. So, the calculation would be Distance between the Sun and Earth equals diameter of the Sun multiplied by 108 which is 1.39 million kilometers into 108 and that comes to 149,520,000 kilometers. It was a feat that was remarkable for its accuracy and precision, and it was a testament to the incredible knowledge and wisdom that had been accumulated by Indian scholars over the centuries. So to have life on a planet, it is necessary to have its sun approximately 108 times the size and 108 times the sun's diameter between them. For this exact reason, 108 is considered a sacred number in Hinduism, Buddhism and many other religions. When we look into the universe we can see 108 being used by universe everywhere. That would be our next topic. Please subscribe and watch out for our upcoming video on the topic. The Brihat Samhita would go on to become one of the most important texts in Indian astrology, and its influence would be felt for centuries to come. It was a text that contained the secrets of the universe, waiting to be discovered by those who dared to seek them out. And it was a text that would inspire generations of scholars and scientists to explore the mysteries of the universe and unlock the secrets of the cosmos. Thanks for watching. Please do like, share and subscribe.